New trails are coming to the Arkansas River, connecting Jinx to the city of Tulsa. 2 News anchor Sharon Phillips explains what the project will look like and where the money is coming from. Tony Rodriguez loves to hit the trails on his recumbent trike. You will often find him out here three to four times a week, riding 25 to 30 miles a day. Personally, I, I have trouble on a road bike anymore. I had two back surgeries this last summer, and so it's hard for me to sit on a road bike, so I made the change to a trike. And uh, I've put over 2,000 miles on it and lost 70 pounds. The Jinx City Council approved an agreement with the Indian Nations Council of Government, or INCOG, for the design and installation of a multi-use trail along the west side of the Arkansas River. Here is a map of what the project will look like. The orange blocks show trails that already exist. The black and yellow blocks show the proposed riverfront connection. The city of Jinx says the project will separate bicycles and pedestrians from motorized vehicles to make it safer for everyone. That's great. I, I park up at 96th and ride all the way to uh, as far as I can on the west down and over the bridge and onto the west side. So anything that gets added to it is just that much more great riding areas. Evan Liu walks his dog Princess along the trails and loves the idea. Oh, that'd be amazing. I really like that, you know. One of the things I like about it is how the uh, this trail connects to the mountain and if, if more connections the better. The project connects into other trails including Turkey Mountain and there are multiple improvements included in the Tulsa Jinx Riverfront Connections project. One of the improvements includes installing electric vehicle charging stations on both sides of the river. Others include the installation of four bike share stations with 10 geofence bikes, installing improved trail signage, and of course, adding 7.75 miles of multi-use trails. Sharon Phillips, 2 News Oklahoma. $5 million covers the west side of the river from north of 71st down to 104th. The feds will pay for most of it. Jinx voters approved a little over a million dollars, and the overall project is around $20 million. Jinx will partner with the city of Tulsa and INCOG, and it should take about three years to finish.